Pickers, holy smokes, we're here in our pajamas. We're gonna get into this big Bessie. I'm about to move her over to the flat spot. What am I talking about? <laughs> and we're gonna dive into part two of this unit. Football cards in there. So we'll have to actually go through those. We're gonna dive in, see what else we could find in this storage unit. We bought two storage units, we went through one, wasn't great. We'll make a profit, but it wasn't, it just was not fun. This one had a little bit more kind of zest to it. We're gonna do the second half of that bad boy right now, yes. What's up, pickers? How are you doing? We got a new storage unit and we're gonna go through it. Let's do it. Before we do that, let me grab a do rag, two hats, a new bag, and fiddle with this doodad. We buy storages, loving them fresh oranges. Some of the best, sexiest hair since Zach Morris's. So saddle up and take a ride with me. We find a treasure today. A pickers warehouse TV. There's a box. This is not like a very good box. Look at that. The desert bullet. The dessert bullet. It's kind of dirty. This is all like cooking stuff, dude. The rapid egg cooker. These are just very cheap, dirty pans. Oh, there's something kind of cool right there. What is this? Okay. A piece of, there's a piece of art. An old something. I'm not quite sure. It's kind of different. Rocks and their stories. <laughs> Let's take the box out. The box is the last thing in there. Hopefully it's something cool. It says blender. And that's what it is. It's a new blender. A new old blender. Look at that. Hamilton Beach. Is that a thing? Here's a heavy one. Oh, we're just going to transfer it. Yeah! Damn, that's big. Let's dive right into it. Oh, there's a little kitty. Is that a puppy? That's like a puppy kitty. A soft, realistic looking one. We got a bag. This is all dog stuff. And then leashes and stuff. Bunch of leashes. We got a gold pan. That's kind of cool. This is... A random holder of things. Let's see how bad this is. Now these are quite cool, quite collectible. This one's kind of nasty. I mean, I guess we'll try to sell it, but I, I wouldn't feel great about it. I'd have to sell it so cheap to feel decent about it, but I know it has value, but still, it looks yucky to me. We've got a Sears Craftsman disc sander, heavy. You got a PV backstage guitar amp with a cord. We might be able to shred that, huh? I don't know, maybe 20 bucks, maybe. That's a cool cup. That's the only other thing out of this giant tub that I kept. All right, we got some gnomes popping out of this one. 1995, they're a little bit older. That's kind of cool. We'll bring those out and see what happens. There is a camping pot. That's not bad either. Be still and know that I am God. Lounge sit and float. That's really cool. That's really cool. I like that. There's two of them. <laughs> Bird feeders. Those are cool. Glass. Okay, we'll bring those out. We got a bag here of rocks. Stones. Multiple bags of stones, not bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we got nine camping chairs, wow. Nine different camping chairs. There might be more, look at this. We got a bicycle pump, love those. I already have a couple really good ones, so we will bring that one to the flea market. We got some weird kind of random stuff. I don't know if we looked at this yet. That's a really heavy cast iron thing. When the units start to look a little poopy, there's only one thing to do. Get your motor running. Head out on the highway. 
Looking for adventure. Whatever comes our way. Ooh, darling, gonna make it happen. And love when I love and bring. He ain't on the concrete, baby. I love in the space. Like a true nature. So that's pretty cool. That's one of those carts. Original price of 75 bucks. Everybody likes little carts, so that'll be a decent little sale. We got a nice big Samsonite. Now these are expensive new, but you know what? I never have great luck with them. Some people try to get a lot of money for these at the flea market. I don't. Sometimes I'll just give them away. I'm kind of in this for the treasure hunt and making money back and profits is kind of a byproduct of that. Christmas lights. We got a handy cam. That's cool. That'll make that would be a good little electronics lot. Nice little handy cam. Boom. Alright. I see another camera bag. Fuji. Let's see what's in the Fuji. Alright. This guy. Little Fuji buddy. And then there's a flash. Nice looking flash. This little lens. That might be the best thing we found today. And then that big lens. Tamron. Nice big Toshiba lens. The rest of this is just Christmas lights. Do I have a knife on me? That's the question. There she is, Pickers. The last box. Hoping it's the best box. Let's jump right in and we got another box. <laughs> Open this one. Stereos. Those are bags. Stereo. Stereo. Speaker, speaker. Speakers. Speakers and stereo. Look at that. That's a thing. That's a Boss 2.0 Audio Systems Capacitor. Alright. Bunch of cables. This is money. This is all money looking for money. I'm looking for excitement, but it is money. Let's see what this guy is. There's a speaker. There's a thing. Battery tender. There's more lug nuts. So we got an amp here. This is garbage. With that little amp thing. We got another stereo. Another whole bag of parts and pieces. Get this one here. Let's see, I think he goes. There's another big amp. Satellite radio. And another big amp. Parts and pieces. Let's not forget here. We got that amp too. And we got that amp. So, there it is. And of course there's these pieces of art we kind of looked at last time and a couple of like Amazon clothes racks and just stuff a couple little things a couple boxes I didn't even show because it was kind of boring but I don't know I'm, there's value there the stereo stuff we found some money here today for sure but kind of kind of not that exciting thank you, thank you. Downtown ladies sing this song, do da, do da. Tortuga. That's a Budweiser fishing pole. You think the fish is drunk once you get him? <laughs> <laughs> How cool is that? I don't drink beer, but that's still kind of cool. You got a Pepsi one? She remembers when she was trying to look. Oh, mm -hmm. I call I call her son already. But he didn't really respond too much. <laughs> he, 
he had this stuff for all allergies. Okay. Yeah. Somebody told my cousin that this is good. That good side is, is a lot of money. Yeah, that's real. That's good. That's Cy Young. If you take time, mm -hmm. you can find out because he won this award. You can look at the year. Oh my God, I haven't made ID. 1971 Cy Young MVP. Okay, who is that though? Vita Blue. Vita Blue. Mm -hmm. Now we say Vita Blue autograph. And then you look at his autograph. It's the same. So probably real. Vita Blue autograph baseball. Is it Paola Mico? So you go here. Now people selling the same baseball, we mm -hmm. see what they sold it for. This one, eight, 19, 19, 19, 15, 40, 100. So mm -hmm. 20 to 100 for this. Mm -hmm. yeah. You put it on the internet, more. Here, mm -hmm. and like I'm moving, I don't have the space for, for this stuff now. Yeah, yeah. Yes, it's, 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 I don't have the space. But it looked real to me. Yeah. Yep. Do you want to see the, the comic book? Yeah, I'd love to. Mm -hmm. Ruth. This one has comic books. All of them? One or all? some cards in it you have some cards too Incredible Hulk. all right so what we just did was help a lady help a lady kind of figure out what she had we pulled her baseball out we figured out who actually signed it then we looked at the signature to make sure that it matched up with the real signature and then we gave her some prices on it so she she didn't know where to start wouldn't know how to do that so anytime we can help another reseller kind of figure out what they're doing why not right she could use those tools in the future price her stuff more uh, appropriately really really cool good morning good morning how are you i seen him catch a fish one time two times it's big how's it going hello what you been i observe this beautiful hoodie is this from oregon it is from the Ooh. last blog restaurant on earth Bend, Oregon. Dude, and that's a beautiful city on its own. Yeah. I love it. I wish my GoPro had more battery. We don't have enough battery for video today, but we're trying. Stay tuned, y'all. All right. I want to say what's up. <laughs> that's all, what's that's up, what's up, figures? Look at all the cool colors. Right? We got Simpsons. Oh, yeah. Rock'em, sock'em, baby. Rock em, old school. Look at all the cool all stuff. Old school, man. Alan does not disappoint, guys. I bought some cool stuff here before. Oh, thank you. I was looking for you last week. I was hanging out with Justin for a long time. Look at that set. You got the set just casually chilling. Let me film that. Look at this. Just casually chilling. You know, Frankenstein? Turtle troll horror hybrid. Hello. It's, I mean, you just were doing your natural thing. I, I pushed the button and it didn't work, but we're here at Mac McDonald's. Not a place that I eat very often, but a place I will definitely have breakfast at. At six in the morning, a fishing day, it's. Right. It's good. Look, we're out here. The sun has not arrived yet. Maybe, just maybe, we will get the transitional bite today. What do you think? That'd be cool. I think it could happen. It's going to be cold. It's going to be cold. It'll be fun. <laughs> I'm wearing two pair of sweats. I'm wearing a t-shirt and two sweatshirts. And a beanie. And I brought a jacket and a pair of pants. But no gloves or, or no face covering. Do you have any gloves? Man, we need, we need gloves. Uh, pickers, we've arrived. Have we arrived? Yeah, it's foggy. Dude, look at the fog. You can't even see where we're gonna go. This is our little, uh, <clears throat> this is the lot where the house would go. We're gonna walk over there. We're gonna start fishing in the, in the fog. I'm kind of excited. Yeah, this should be fun. I've never fished like super fog at this dock, so I'm quite excited. Hopefully we'll pull out some monsters. I might not film too much of it because I wanna enjoy this, but we'll see. That part probably won't make the video. Pickers, we are in the fog. 
Look at us. We, we, we can't. I can't see five feet in front of us. What do you? What about you? No, it's very dark up here. Or foggy. Very foggy. We don't necessarily know exactly. Where you can see the bank over there, but look in front of us. We're just going to the abyss, dude. some really cool fish out of this little foggy greatness that'd be exciting maybe we'll do that let's see wow love you guys see you soon